I'm Dory, and today I'll be answering a question from JY. JY would like to know, can robots communicate with other robots? JY, robots can communicate with one another and in a variety of ways. In some cases, the robots have to be hardwired or connected through cables to interact. Other robots can use Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, or 5G to send and receive signals. Sometimes they even use a combination of these options. Once the robots are connected, either to a network or to one another, they can start sending signals. The signals can be binary or analog. Binary signals are like an on-off switch, while analog signals can give a range of information based on physical activity, like changes in speed of a motor. The first signals sent out between robots are often referred to as handshakes. One robot sends a signal to the other one to establish communication, and once the other one responds, they can start working on whatever task they were programmed to do. This step is especially important to prevent robots from running into one another while they work. Some robots are designed to work in groups for missions like disaster relief. These types of robots are often referred to as swarms and communicate with specialized codes similar to ants or bees. These swarms of robots can use light patterns or other signals to coordinate with each other to accomplish a task, the same way insects use pheromones and motion to work together in nature. While we have made a lot of progress, communication between robots, humans, and their environment still has room for improvement. Maybe one of you out there will be able to take robot communication to the next level. Thanks for watching this episode of Ask Starbase, and a special thank you to JY for asking this question. If you have a STEM question, please email it to ask at starbase-ct.com, or you can send it through our website, starbase-ct.com. Stay safe and be well. Bye.